For those of you who are seeking it, this is your call to devotion, to full commitment, to going all in. Invest in yourself, invest in your dreams. Give yourself the chance to make life your ideal vision. It's too often that we let time slip through our fingers. We don't have forever on this earth. And at some point, we have to take a good look at our life, what we're doing, where we're going, and decide if we think we're worth it or not. And I assure you, you are. We were not put here to fall in line. We were not put here to go through the drive through at McDonald's. We were not put here to go to jobs wearing uniforms that we hate. We were put here to be expressive, to be creative, to expand upon culture, creativity, enlightenment, and community. And we often find ourselves in this trap of thinking there's no way out or we can't break out of certain cycles when in fact it's very simple. You just choose to break the cycle. Now I know, easier said than done, and it may be scary at first, but I can tell you, if you put your faith in yourself and ideally in higher things and proceed forward with the steps necessary, even not knowing how it will go, the answers will come, the solution will come, the progress will come. If you dare, if you are bold enough to stay consistent in your choice, to stand by your devotion, your dedication, your commitment to yourself with strength and integrity, outside judgments be damned, circumstances be damned, have faith and move accordingly. There's sort of an unspoken law with this a key is to not really anticipate how or when your results will come. Just know that they will come and then put in the necessary action. This is a formula that for me has proven time and time again to be true. I decided a long time ago that I was an artist, a performer, a spiritual creator person. Um, I decided to take my own path and I dedicated to that for the long haul. I, I understood that there was no coming back. And for me, that is the best decision I've ever made. Even though my path hasn't been easy, it's brought me this far. And here I stand with goals met and with a heart fulfilled, knowing that I am in the process on my path where, where I should be. It's not all solved. There are still problems, there is still work to be done, but I am assured of where I'm going and there's no better feeling than that. I look back to the absolute existential dread that came with feeling defeated. And if you're feeling defeated, I'm here to tell you you're not. You can make a decision right now, today, to get started on that painting or that degree or that YouTube channel or that whatever it is. The thing that you would be doing in your dream life even if it seems out of reach, even if it seems grandiose, it's not. It's that most people's vision has been limited. And that's intentional. You know, um, our whole life we're taught to 
follow instruction, to fall in line, to present a certain way, to act a certain way. But the fact is, is you don't have to. And I understand bills and kids and everything else. I have those things. So today, I encourage you to be bold and to work towards a plan of creating your ideal life. Do not get stuck in the routine of the mundane. I understand maybe you can't do it all at once, but what you can do is start formulating a plan, start entertaining the idea, start telling yourself where you will be and where you're going and act accordingly. This is your life. I encourage you to make the most of it and I encourage you to treasure every moment with loved ones and to seize every ambition you ever hoped for. Why wouldn't you? What else are you doing? So that's it. Definitely feel free to like and subscribe and get out there.